Hey, quick session tonight. Uh, Nurse Charles here. Um, I had the unfortunate event tonight of intubating a 17-year-old kid. That means we put a tube in his throat to breathe for him because he lost the ability to breathe. He lost consciousness. So let me educate the community real quick. Hookah is not safe. I don't care who tells you that hookah is safe because of the water component and all the steam. Hookah is not safe. Hookah is worse than cigarettes. So you can have one hookah session and you'll get up to 100 times the amount of nicotine in that hookah session that you would get from a cigarette. Think about that. So nicotine goes to your body. It stimulates something called dopamine. And you get this gigantic dopamine rush in your body and that's what gives you the euphoria. That's what's your high, that's what your high comes from. The issue is your body cannot reproduce that naturally. So now, you're, in order for you to have that sensation again, you've got to use a larger amount of that same drug in order to achieve that. That means that you become addicted to nicotine because you want the nicotine to produce the dopamine high. Secondly, the charcoal that are used to heat this stuff up releases something called carbon monoxide. So carbon monoxide is oxygen's enemy. So when your body carries oxygen to cells, that's how you breathe, that's how your body stays alive. Carbon monoxide has a, a much greater affinity to rattle on that red blood cells than oxygen does. So guess what, when that carbon monoxide gets on that on that red blood cell, there's no oxygen there. So you suffer from what's called hypoxia. That means you're basically, your, your cells in your body are suffocating. We've got to stop putting out misinformation to people. Even the kids who brought my guy in thought that he was okay. Thought that it was safe to use hookah. Oh, the water, the flavor. No. And for all the rappers out there who are promoting this stuff, you should be ashamed of yourselves. Because I know you guys know the effects of this stuff and that you're, you're, you're promoting this to young children to use. Got to stop. We got to stop spreading mis misinformation in our communities. We have to. So it's just unfortunate. It's unfortunate to see the youth going through this. But I want you guys to know from a clinical perspective, hookah is worse than cigarettes. And cigarettes are horrible.